Alright, it shouldn't really be too hard. Because it's... Whoa! 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 Spring loaded, spring loaded, spring loaded. Fun fact, when I'm actually recording these videos, I don't wear any pants. Um, I'm something about being free. Ah, just kidding. Although I do like the idea, um, until I get a really comfortable chair, I like to have my balls, like, wrapped around with some fabric. It's like those- Oh, my foot! Oh! It's like those people who can't fall asleep without, you know, being dressed. I am one of those people who I, I, no, I, I need to be naked if I'm sleeping. I don't, I don't understand why people go to bed with clothes on. It's like, this is the one time you have to, uh, to not have to deal with the pressure of wearing clothes. I mean, come on, we're not meant to wear clothes. Anyway, what the fuck? Nearly there, thanks. It's gonna be a good show for you today. I am literally using junk that I've found from storage to get my lighting system set up. This thing is an absolute nightmare. Now, this is the tricky bit because, enough of my conspiracy theory videos, this green, that, is one of the hardest things to get up because my lighting is absolutely crap. But let's try it anyway. And slightly gone. And a bit more to the right. Uh, there we go. Yeah, I'm fading away. I'm fading into time. Doctor Who versus D Doctor Who versus a green screen. Uh, yeah, that is not gonna go away anytime soon. I need to get better lighting. Welcome to the future. Oh, I'm still there. Can I run away from myself? Oh, hey. No, I can't. There you go. No. Never seen so much autism in one video. So I, I could be anywhere right now. I could with this. I'm planning on doing something. I don't even know where I got this. So I, I just I literally just asked for this for Christmas and I thought to myself, you know, what? let's actually try this out. So I with this, I can go anywhere. I could go to the beach. I could go. Um, I could have my own little office behind me, which is great because I need to get a, a different background. I was, what I swim better with hats. Hey, does anyone know why the train is moving? Holy shit. Okay. What's up guys, Shuman here, welcome back to another video. So, welcome! Hello! 2019! Something I totally missed as usual. Uh, I'm late to most things, and uh, so today I wanted to really just break down what I've been doing, uh, what 2019 has been, because wow, it was an interesting one. I managed to break a lot of milestones, hopefully you did as well. For me, it was, I finally managed to get over booze, I finally managed to get over, um, or at least close to it, vaping, and I managed to get 90 days on NoFap. It was a big, big year for me. 2019, 2018, I should say, was a year that I finally managed to conquer the things, or at least come make massive strides in conquering some of the old addictions, and also healing myself physically and psychologically. But most importantly, it taught me so much about structure and meaning and value and stuff like that. I have not been posting that many videos recently, and uh, that that has mainly been because the big transition between uh, me getting over vaping and me doing a lot of the emotional healing so that I could actually get off of vaping uh, was a really, 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 really big thing for me and something that I honestly couldn't do whilst also doing videos. The big issue that I found is that basically I was trying to do too many things at once. I was trying to get off of cigarettes and alcohol. I was trying to build a YouTube channel. I was trying to do all sorts of other things, all of it at once, whilst also trying to hopefully feel my progress. I would have loved to have put on the camera every single time and just sat and talked about my experiences, but I've been such a roller coaster of emotions and I felt so drained some, from, from so many days that it's become really impossible to do. Not only that, but a lot of my health content, and yes, there is more coming, uh, a lot of my health content does require a lot of effort, not only to make, but also to then deal with all of the questions and comments that come afterwards, because I don't like it when, you know, I, I make a video and then people have a lot of questions and I'm just like, whatever. But the problem is, is that I've become overwhelmed with all three things to the point where I've had to basically turn inward in, in on myself and practice something that I like to call enlightened self-interest. That is to say, I shut everyone else out to try and focus on myself, because ultimately, I cannot help you guys, I cannot help anyone if I do not focus on myself. Now, a few things that I wanted to touch on. Uh, one of them is that I have been trying to come up with a way of how to make videos without making me a big enough target, because I have a lot of things to talk about. Some of them are PC, some of them are not. Some of them are very controversial, some of them are not. And I'm still trying to figure out a way to navigate the online landscape whilst actually without first, you know, digging a premature grave of myself. Now, I'm not too worried about, oh, you know, I'm gonna get banned or as more and more people are subjected to, to this. And also because I live in uh, the UK, which if you didn't know, 
arrests a thousand people every single year for hate speech online so there's also that too it's more just the fact that i want my message to reach out to as many people as possible and with the amount of demonetization and sort of all sorts of stuff you know going on and not just not just demonetization it's also just the outright censorship it's 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 i'm trying to figure out a way to navigate it whilst also avoiding that but that's all coming in now what i really wanted to point out was uh that i actually have a timetable for for what well, we move over here, over here i actually have a timetable for what i'm actually going to be doing I've got the next few weeks planned out as to what videos I'm, I'm going to do. Mainly because it was very hard for me to try and, you know, juggle work and everything else without having some sort of structure. Now, I did have this before, but I never was actually following it. So, as you can see, I will be actually starting a juice fast from the 18th, uh, which I'm going to be doing properly this time instead of just, I was having calories in, in other forms. So, I'll be doing it and I'll be talking about what recipes I'm doing and stuff like that. Um, I've also got three tips for better skin because I know people are on at me for the health videos. That should be coming out on the 19th. Now, I, I will be working for the next two days, but uh, on Saturday, I plan to just literally, I've, I've already got the script done, I'll, I'll just be pumping that out. Also, I've got another video. It won't just be NoFap on the 20th. It will be another video, hopefully, if, if, if I manage to get it done with all the work and stuff, talking about just Gillette and stuff like that and all the stupid shit that they're doing. So I really am looking for this year to have to be the year whereby I can basically sit and say okay now now that I've got a lot of this turbulence out you know out the way now let's just focus on you know getting my YouTube career off the ground because believe it or not even though there are loads of videos out there that, that I didn't actually put out I do actually want to be a YouTuber and uh, and I'm also getting on an age so I'd like to do something a bit more practical instead of just fiddling with other stuff I am planning on doing a lot more other online ventures but for now I'm just planning on doing YouTube, just focusing in on that and building a stable base because I say this to anyone, if you are under the age of 20, like four or 23, like this is literally the best. I mean, hell, if you, if you, if you, if you're in, 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 um, in your twenties, this is literally the best time to be alive because it's so easy to make money. Like it's, there's so many opportunities out there to try and just to try and just make a name for yourself. And I aim by the time I'm 40 latest to retire. And I aim, I mean, if, if pushing that, I want to, by the time I'm 35, not have to work a single day in my life and just live on passive income. But that's something for the far, far future. But seriously, like now is the best time to be alive. And we don't know how long the internet's going to be around in its current form with stuff like Article 13 coming out, whereby people are basically being censored. And um, basically Article 13, if you haven't actually heard of it, is um, if you post a video on the internet, unless you own the exact rights to every single image, every single link, every single video clip, you are likely to be censored and YouTube has an obligation to basically either demonetize you or take down the video. Now, this is only in Europe, but uh, Europe is fucking big if you hadn't actually realized it. And they are quite literally going to shut down most of the things that we see online like videos like this where where i link to sources would have to i'd have to own the sources which, which would be impossible if not for the fact that brexit is happening which is a total shit show right now but still it's going to happen regardless of whether we like it or not so the uk shouldn't be subject to that but stuff like that makes it very very hard we are going into 2019 and it's going to be a very very interesting year so i plan to on this channel once my work is uh, stabilized just a little bit more uh, talk about all sorts of stuff like current events. Um, I, I want to I, I wanna talk about politics because there's a lot of stuff going on, like the whole MGTOW versus feminism thing, and not just that because it is such a micro niche aspect. What it really, what what really is the issue I think that I need to talk about is the fact that we are being led astray from multiple different levels of analysis. We are being led astray in the school system, led astray at work. Let, let, let us stray by our governments, let, let us stray by everyone, by religion, by everyone. And there's just so much shit that I need to talk about. And I quite literally cannot do it if I'm trying to also get off of nicotine, alcohol, trying to quit sugar, trying to juice fast, and then trying to film it whilst also having an unstable work life. <gasps> so, welcome to 2019. I'm back to posting. I should be done with the uh, post with, with responding to comments. And I'll see you all later. Peace.